Hey guys, it's Batman Mark here at Playmobil. We're here with our friend Sarah, who's going to take us through the new product line for 2020, to, uh, 2020 2022 as well. <laughs> it's back to the future. Hey, hey, we're going ahead to the future. <clears throat> so I'm looking here in the uh, beautiful glass showcase, and I see something that has totally blown me away. It's part of my childhood. I grew up with this. Why don't you give us a lowdown on it? So this is our upcoming very exciting for this particular uh, line of three sets coming out in January. And obviously the, the centerpiece of that line is the iconic Mystery Machine Band. You get three of the gang with it, which is uh, Velma, Daphne, and Fred. And then separately you can do Scooby, Shaggy, and the Ghost. And then we'll be doing blind bags in January as well. And it'll feature some of the iconic ghosts from the original series. So let me go, let me go back real, here, real quick here to Scooby and Shaggy. This is a three pack? Yes. In one set. Got it. Very good. And the mystery machine comes with the three original, the three original figures. Daphne, Velma, and Freddy, yeah. and the ex extra accoutrement, yeah. and the mystery machine. Comes with these little ghost cards. You can see them in the blue case there. There's three sitting there, and then you can see it. Shed. All right. I'm scooping. I'm. I'm. Blah. I'm zooming in on the ones in the box between Daphne and Freddy, and, and the then. Ghost will come with them as well. You can see Shaggy is holding one in this set. And then the ghosts will each get them in the, the mystery bags as well. And those are ghost cards that can be, there's a slot inside the mystery machine that can be slid in and illuminated to see the ghosts that you have captured. So they're kind of a collectible feature of the various ghosts from this series. Now, uh, in talking with uh, your teacher, your mentor, Linda explained to me that there's something special about each one of these individual figures. Can you uh, illuminate us? about Scooby-Doo, which makes it a really great fit for Playmobil, is that ghosts are not really ghosts. From the classic series, ghosts are always people dressed up as ghosts. They're never really supernatural creatures. It always turns out to be a human and somebody that they know. And so that's true of this line as well. All these ghosts are figures in disguise as ghosts. So it's very true to the original Scooby, but it's also true to Playmobil, whose centerpiece is also the, uh, the figure. That's great. So, Freddie's famous line, let's see who's underneath the mask. Yes, and it's always someone they knew. It's always so-and-so from down the street, you know? That's great. And this is going to be available to us when? So these specific sets will be available in January, and then we'll have additional sets available next fall. And those sets will include things like the Mystery Mansion. They'll have different scenes from different worlds that come up in the different episodes. So it'll be expanded upon next fall. Very good, very good. So this is post-Christmas season. So this will be, yes, January 2020, what you're looking at. And then there will be additional sets in fall 2020. Very good. Can you enlighten us as to what's uh, Wave 2 going to look like? Yeah, Wave 2 will have the mystery mansion. It'll have the, the mansion thing. itself. Hidden features, trap doors, all the secret stuff that's happened. Cool. There'll be a cemetery involved. We'll have Scooby and Shaggy with their pizza and all their snacks, because you know how much Scooby and Shaggy love food. Love their Scooby snacks. Very good. And when I go to the back of the mystery machine and you look inside, <clears throat> it, you literally did a phenomenal job in the detail of it. I don't know if I can get really close into that. There's not enough lighting inside the vehicle itself, but you've got bench seating for each one of them. Yes, so there's two seats in the cab and the cab roof comes off. Also the, the van, the back of the van, the roof also comes off. There's at least two seats there and then I believe there are two fold down seats as well. So there's plenty of seating. Yeah, I was looking at the seating inside the benches, which are really nice. The detail. has always prided itself on, and that's something we would never want to lose with any product line that we create. So the attention to detail will always be something that Playmobil makes an effort for. Absolutely. And I just love, you've got all kinds of accoutrement inside, the little food tray. Yeah, all the details, all those little I don't know if we can get in there. feel authentic. It even says Scooby Snacks inside on the bag. I love that. And then that's the... It has to be Scooby Snacks. And that's the screen you were talking about. You put each one of the ghost cards. Inside the, the ghost card in there, and then there'll be a button with the turn on the light, and it'll illuminate what ghost you have captured. Very cool. Is there any other lighting inside the vehicle in the back cab? Nope, just that. Very cool. All right, guys, we're moving on. You guys have another amazing lineup that I'm so happy for, because I, this is another one that I grew up with, and... The up oh, the sizzle just popped up, but I'm coming over here 
to see the real piece, the real production. So we've got Back to the Future. This, oh my God. So this is only phase one. It is, it's the original film. This will be launching in May. And what you're looking at are four different sets. The top one here is all one set with the DeLorean. You get Doc and Marty in their 1980s outfits. You get Einstein, the dog. You've got your plutonium case with the different plutonium cores to function with the vehicle. So it's all very authentic. There'll be lights on the DeLorean, both exterior, actual vehicle lights, but also interior for the flux capacitor. So the, the light blue section. clear section yep. of the car, all the wiring and cables will actually light up. Uh, yeah, the video as well. And the sizzle, look at that. We may, we may have to scan the sizzle. Oh, look at that, yeah. Very cool, perfect timing. Now, does Einstein fit in the vehicle? Have you? I don't believe unless you leave a figure out. I mean, Einstein can go in the vehicle if somebody doesn't go. Well, remember, Marty tests it first by putting Einstein, Einstein into it. sit in the vehicle like a human. Boy. This is true. So, that would be a little harder. But then in addition to these, obviously, it's all about time travel. So, we're going to have a small two-pack with Doc and Marty in their 1950s outfits as well. And there he is playing the guitar. Very cool. And then an expansion of the more collectibles line. We're going to be doing individual six-inch six figures for the 80s costumes as well. So you'll get Doc Brown and then you can have Marty with a skateboard. I'm glad you took that back. The six-inch figure line. I'm not going to mention who had it first, but you allowed them to do a couple and I was very disappointed you didn't do it yourself. But you've, you've redeemed yourself. Playmobil has redeemed themselves. Thank you. Yeah, well, and then the sizzle card that. for that as well. <clears throat> so this is series one and two. <clears throat> this whole set comes as one complete unit. Yeah. All right. And of course, since there are three movies, I'm sure that if this does really well for you, we can Obviously, look forward. Here, There's at least three more time, time machines. <laughs> Sarah, thank you so much for giving us a tour. All right, again, this is Batman Mark from New York Comic Con 2019, and we're out.